right now, though, there's, there's no more thing, right? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What you've just heard is the sound of a burn dressing being performed in Uganda. Burns are all too common in low-income countries. I carry a burden on my heart to do something about this. My name is Dr. Robin Evans, and I'm the Pediatric Plastic Surgery Fellow here at the University of British Columbia. When a burn occurs, the skin's normal function is disrupted. You become susceptible to infection and lose the ability to maintain normal fluid balance. Without prompt treatment, even small burns can be devastating. Deformity, disfigurement, and social isolation are common. Many do not survive. I propose a new way to treat burns in low-income countries. We call it the Burn Survival Kit. The kit itself is designed to be a first contact resource for burns. It is comprised of oral rehydration salts for inexpensive resuscitation, a silver-based nanotechnology wound dressing, and a way to get help, a connection to a local burn center through cell phone technology. Oral rehydration salts will provide an inexpensive way to quickly replenish a patient's fluids. The burn dressing is a significant development. By use of a process called electrospinning, we can create nanofibers of silver that can be woven into a fabric-like material extremely inexpensively. There's even the possibility of spinning in local anesthetic into our dressing, giving a significant improvement on the dressings, dressings we currently use in Canada. The Burn Survival Kit allows for burns in low-income countries to be treated earlier. This approach has the potential to reduce the incidence of scar contracture by 50% and mortality by 25%. Something needs to be done and we're humbly asking you to help us. Thank you.